Scientists wonder if there could be extraterrestrial aliens living among us. Well, we know that Paul Hellyer, the former Defense Minister of Canada, used to go around lecturing people and, and uh, disclosing that there are various types of extraterrestrials among us, and some of them look exactly like us. If we were to pass them on the sidewalk on the street, we would know that they were extraterrestrials, he claimed. A team of scientists from the University of California has come up with an unusual hypothesis that suggests that aliens settled on Earth for a long time and live among us uh, as observers. Of course, there's no evidence of this, but according to ancient sources, including in the Bible, representatives of extraterrestrial civilizations visited our planets, our planet. In 2000, scientists at the University of California, led by Professor Jonathan Malkisum, gave a press conference during which the sensational news that representatives of extraterrestrial civilizations have long existed among humans was reported. They have a human appearance and closely monitor our every move, he claimed. Adrian Kent, the perimeter of Institute or Theoretical Physics of Canada said, it's like an extreme version of the camouflage found in some insects and animals. Furthermore, according to historical records, there have been aliens on Earth since the beginning of creation. Ancient philosophers were always looking for the answer to the question of whether the beings who came from heaven were members of the same race as angels, but usually the answer was no, because the beings who arrived were mortal, while angels, of course, are eternal. The question of extraterrestrial civilizations had disappeared for centuries, only to resurface for the first time in the 20th century. For the United States, John F. Kennedy, a few days before he passed, asked the head of the CIA to provide him with all the material related to the incident, but it's assumed that he was not able to access the most secret files. And from the 1950s to the present day, many people claim not only to have seen a UFO appear in the sky, but to have been inside these objects and even had contact with extraterrestrials. Everything is fine so far before they did not have contact, so you just didn't learn them because there were only uh, a few newspapers around. Of course, today we have our cell phones and we can very easily take pictures and videos of them, of anything strange. So from 1950 until today, have you ever wondered why some circles have such a range or to mock ridicule such issues and of course to say that uh, they don't exist this limited perception that may have that many have is not accidental including scientists everyone has a completely wrong understanding of the subject once again many talk about reptilians without understanding anything themselves and at the end they have taken it for a joke or for another ridiculous conspiracy theory. And uh, they have not even thought that about the size of the conspiracy under their noses, literally, which destroys what they know about life itself. Others will think that they'll see among them some in the form of reptilians and some they don't see at all uh, before their theories uh, turn into conspiracies. And just my comment here, we do have a lot of written texts, ancient texts, from anywhere from ancient Greece. They believed that the Olympian gods were actually from the stars. Uh, the ancient Egyptians had written annals concerning the sky gods, the original overlords of the pharaohs of Egypt. We also had about 2,400, 500 BC the written annals of China, Korea, and Japan, that they had extraterrestrials landing in their countries. So they, this was around the same time that they were landing in Egypt, 2500 BC. Isn't that strange? Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Please support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support.
and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.